hello everyone welcome back again to my channel my name is elam so in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you guys some very yummy delicious and most importantly pocket friendly african party um food recipe ideas so here both your vips your regular your vvips every category of your guests are covered in this video so if you're interested please watch this video to the end let's go okay so let's begin from nigeria because i'm a nigerian okay so you know that in nigeria when you want to serve your guest we normally start with um small chops that's um finger food okay you don't just start serving rice or swallow or anything you start with finger food so for finger food you can make this yummy coated peanuts okay you can serve um this coated peanut as part of your finger food okay things they can be chewing before the main meal okay you can, you can call it appetizer but in nigerian party there must be something to chew first before the main meal okay so either that um coated peanut or you could also um serve them chin chin okay yeah you could make chin chin and serve to your guests you can also pair this chin chin with um, normal peanuts not coated one normal peanut or even the coated one but normal peanut is better okay after that you could also make these bonds this um younger sister or twin sister of a uh, puff puff okay you can see how it is just like the same size with the puff puff and now here comes the almighty and regular puff puff who doesn't like puff puff in the party you must eat puff puff so you make your puff puff and serve again another very popular one is a uh, samosa samosa is another very um, popular finger food when you come to nigeria parties you have samosa and you have the twin sister as well which is spring rolls these two must always come together <laughs> so you can make your spring rolls and add it okay it goes very well again this one is not too popular but i tell you we've tried this in some parties and it's yum just um fried um plantain and yam with this hot sauce i tell you guys if you, if you taste this sauce you want to make it every week and this plantain and yam cut it abnormally okay not the normal size then we proceed to the swallow which is the soup soup this is Ozeza soup, guys, you can never go wrong. In fact, if you make this soup for your guests, they'll be asking you, when are you having another party? When are you having another party? <laughs> so make this Ozeza soup or this pocket-friendly Egusi soup. Yeah, Egusi is one of the most affordable soup when you're having a party. You can never go wrong with Egusi soup. There are a lot of soup as well. You can make um, bitali soup, although depending on your tribe in Nigeria, okay, so we have different ty tribes rather um, and different soups. So a goosey soup is one of them. You could also make aura soup or ha soup. We will call it or a number of people call it aura. So you could also make this yum, delicious yum, yum or ha soup for your guests. Okay. If you don't want to make or soup, you could also make bitter leaf soup. Okay. Bitter leaf soup is another party soup that. Um, your guest will fall in love with yeah bitter leaf soup is another one then if you proceed to our neighboring um other parts of the country like the aquabomites you could make um afang soup you could make a detang soup okay different soup there are so many soup you can make like i said depending on your tribe in nigeria then if you proceed to the western part of nigeria you could make a way do you could make a forero in fact i will soon change my name more because of a, a way do i will soon change my name to lua femi a way do because the way i love this a malani way do eh? anyway that's the story for another day so you could make that okay then we proceed to the swallow because all the soup 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 you must eat it with one solid or the other swallow and guys this is not pounded yeah but what you're looking at is not pounded this is rice fufu and it's very cheap. You can make this. And I tell you, your guests will not know that this is rice fufu. They think it's pounded yam. Okay. 
Then another fufu they can, you can pair with any of this soup. It's gari. Of course, we know gari is always on popular demand. <laughs> okay. So you could make gari or the, the main, another popular one is fufu. Okay. In fact, with the way the situation of the country is, anything you make and present now, my brothers and sisters, there will be no leftover. There is hunger in the land. Then amalaka also make amala. This is another swallow that you can make for your guests. Okay. Amala. Mm. Then another one, you could also make buyam porridge. Okay. Now we've moved away from the swallows, the solid. Now you could also make yam porridge. Guys, I tell you, I've tried this in a party before. It's so nice. So test. You can make porridge yam for your guests. Then the almighty and evergreen Niger Jelof. Yay! Ghana people make Unano the drag jelof with also. In fact, we will soon enter Ghana very soon. So for the rice, of course, which party will, will go on? In fact, will be complete without Nigeria jelof. So you make your jelof rice, different shades of jelof rice. You also make your fried rice. You make your um fried rice and serve your guests okay and not just um, jollof and fried you could also make another type of rice yes white sauce with white rice your guests will love this this is also another popular demand you could also make coconut rice though it's a bit more expensive but if you do it i tell you this one will finish first coconut rice yes or just white rice and stew. But guys, look at that white rice very well. It's not just ordinary white rice. It's mixed with very attractive veggies. Then pair it with your stew. Just add your stew to it. But don't make it just ordinary white rice. Make that rice colorful. That white rice, make it colorful, attractive. A couple of the points now. <laughs> yes. Then there are some sides that you can pair with the rice. Of course, if you come to Niger party, moi moi is now trending. You can pair the rice with moi moi as in the side. You can add moi moi as a um, part of the side um, for your party. Okay. And guys, one thing I've forgot to say since I started this video, most of these recipes are right here on my channel. Okay. So check them out and watch please then another side of course we know that goes with rice very well is salad you can never go wrong with salad in fact some people might not even want to eat rice they don't want to eat swallow they just want to have salad with what chicken they just want to keep it light and simple you know as they come for your party so this is um chicken we are now moving to the protein of course if you've seen chicken you could also make a um, mixed meat that is yeah yes um cow foods um cow head cow, the skin you can also add them um, gizzard as well if you want and then um, another protein is fish you could also um, make fish for your guests okay this you could also make this just for your vips because we know yeah fish is expensive guys so yeah fish is another protein then you another one is beef yeah you know that beef is another um party meat that it's always at high demand so you just make it and then um, mix it with a uh, chicken and other um proteins that you have okay then of course we proceed to another vip so if i vvip package first one is pepper soup guys let's be honest it, although it depends on the size of your party, it, most times you cannot make pepper soup that will be that will go around for everybody. So it's always for the reserved for the VIPs pepper soup, and this yummy boneless cow food unkwobi. Of course, guys, this is for the VIPs. Do you want to give your VIPs or VIPs bones? No, you can't give them bone to chop now. <laughs> they will not be happy with you so try and get the boneless one make this yummy umpo before them and like i said earlier they'll be asking you all the time man are you having another party now then another vvip package is this yummy and yummy peppered gizzard guys like i said you can't go wrong with this hmm? forget about that cup by the side concentrate on the peppered gizzard you understand what I'm saying now? I cut another point. Yeah. Make this and your guest will love you. 
another VVIP package is Ogba. Hey, 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 Ogba. Hey, guys, if you can make this for everyone, fine. Like I said, depending on the size of your party, then, oh, to me, mm, mm, the most important part is fruits, guys. You will agree with me. Who will make a uh, uh, fruit for everybody that comes? The order depends on the size of the party, but this one is always for the VVIPs. Fruit salad, you know, and with other fruits by the side, guys. You can't go wrong with this. In fact, okay, now let's proceed to our neighboring country. Aquaba, my people, Ghana people. Hey, hey, I hear Luna. So you can make this waki. I hope I got the name right. For your guests, this food is so yummy. Okay, I've tested it before. Then, for all those um, small chops or finger food that I mentioned earlier, the chicken, guys, if you don't know what to serve your guests with it, just pair it for them with this shito. Guys, oh, if you've never tried Ghana shito, oh, God, oh my God, guys, this is so yummy. But to be honest, I didn't make this shito. This was given to me by my very good uh, Ghana neighbor. Mm? But I love shito a lot. Then you could also make this um, a light chicken soup. As you can see, very yummy. I've tried these recipes before. That's why I'm telling you guys. And you can also make banku. Okay, guys. So with these few points of mine. Yeah, I hope you've been able to grab one or two. Um, recipe ideas for your next party if you have please give me thumbs up okay and um, subscribe share and i'll see you in my next one love you guys bye <music>